Chapter 8, 10.55pm Hey guys, it's August and welcome back to some more Ghost Trick. I went to try and rescue prisoner D99 even under ordinary circumstances that prison has a strange atmosphere, but this time there's something even stranger about it. Yeah, last time Lin asked us to come and uh, rescue prisoner D99 aka Detective Jowd because his execution was going to be held tonight and not at dawn like it usually is, so something's going on here. An execution with my memory gone, I don't have a clear image of what that is in my head, but even I can sense a strong feeling or foreboding that hangs in the air. Maybe I'm too late. Well here we are back at the guard's office. And something's going on. So how's it going? With the generator? In the basement? What is he doing? <laughs> They're trying to fix it now, it's going to take a while they said. They haven't even gotten the internal phone there back up yet. I just hope the rowdies don't rush the guard room. Uh, we don't have any rowdies here. <laughs> and what's more, the one who committed the most atrocious crime isn't even here anymore at all. You promised not to talk about that. What is going on? It seems that the generator of the prison got taken down somehow. Look, would you knock it off for that weird flipping and flopping around? I can't stand looking at it. If you don't stop, I just might have to pound you. This, this is a glorious dance. Oh, it's, it's the dance of his people, isn't it? When you don't know what else to do, dance, dance, dance. We call it the panic dance. Wow, that's a really good thing for a guard to be doing in a prison. <laughs> well, I guess he can just keep doing that. Who's this? This is special detention calling from the death chamber. The internal phone is finally back up. It's pitch black down here though, until they get the generator going again. How's it going up there? The phone's been ringing off the hook from headquarters. Oh boy, we can't let the existence of this prison become known to the outside world. We'll have to run out the prisoner somehow, is Bailey dancing? Yes, yes he is. Yup, you should see him. Take a video of it, we can watch it together when we're done. Once the generator's back up, I'll record it with the security camera. Good plan. Well, that's interesting. So somehow the generator went down, which, yeah, probably means that all the rowdies, as Bailey said, it can get out. I was actually thinking about this as well, and according to Lin, the reason Jowd is getting executed is because he asked for it. I'm pretty sure you can't actually ask to be executed. <laughs> I think it's the judge who decides what your sentence is, but I suppose this is, like, weird America slash Japanese land or whatever. What's going on, Bailey? Generator still not up. I can't keep this up much longer. Then just stop dancing. Exactly. Will you dance instead then? <laughs> Does somebody have to dance? Oh yes, somebody has to do it. Oh, now it's speeding up. If that somebody is me, I'll keep dancing until I drop. I like the music. <laughs> okay. There's nothing we can really do here, but the internal line is back up, so let's head over to the uh, internal extension. Ooh, down to special detention. Here we go. Yeah, it's pitch black down here. Those guys are working at the moment. What are they talking about? This is not good. Not good at all. Wow, these guys are exactly the same. <laughs> yeah, I feel like a ghost is going to show up any minute now. Hey, come on, show some respect. There's a dead man here. Wait, what? Uh. Wait, was it actually like a joke? Or did somebody die? Um, well, I guess we'll see in a second. Let's go to the ghost world. No, I can't see any bodies here. Maybe that was just a joke to try and spook the other guy. I guess darkness doesn't really exist in the ghost world. Even without light, I can still see what's going on. I can use the ghost world to help you find the generator. So let's see what we have here with the internal phone. We have a lever. Uh, a power supply, an emergency light, another light, a water drop. Oh. Wait a second, it's him! But it looks like he's asleep. Can I? See, so what are you thinking? The big guy seems to be taking a nap here. I doubt my poultry powers are enough to wake him. Rest in peace, curry lover. <laughs> it's kind of spooky when a ghost says it. 
Yeah, as soon as I saw this guy just lying here, I was like, wait a second, did, did he die? <laughs> but nope, our big curry loving baby is okay. Well, I guess we'll manipulate the power supply. What the hell is that? Is that the generator? <laughs> it looks like a freaking drill. Another one. Oh geez, where did that wrench go? Without it, I can't tighten the last bolt of the generator. I sure wish I could see you in the dark like a cat. Or like a ghost. Yep. Uh, let's manipulate this. Doesn't seem to be responding. I guess it's not going to work until we put that bolt back in. So what else do we have here? We have the wrench down here. I've seen things before. Some kind of tool for turning things. It's leaning up against the wall. If I knock it over, I wonder if he'll notice. It's too heavy. It won't budge. Uh, so not much we can do in this room. Unless we could manipulate the light up here somehow. Trick? No. Nothing. I guess we'll head back to, over to the other side then. So what are these two guys doing? Uh, I guess I could flip this lever. And that did nothing. Huh. Maybe there's actually nothing to do here. Alright guys, I'm back. So I just spent about 5 minutes looking around trying to figure out where to go because I wasn't really sure and I just found it. I'm probably going to cut it the last 5 minutes just because it was me looking around rambling and being confused. But yeah, the way to get past the section is kind of sneaky, so good one game. Before I do that though, I will show you guys the other sections of the prison because everything's just gone. The prisoners are all gone, Jowd's not here, the Rockstar's gone too. The cells are wide open so all the prisoners could escape. Obviously, this is playing by, like, FNAF rules, where when the power goes out, everything opens up, because that makes sense. Well, I suppose it does in some cases, but not in prison. <laughs> like, you want to keep the prisoners in, don't you? And, like, to be fair, I think a prison of this side would probably have, like, tons of backup power generators, too, but... Once again, I suppose we are in a crazy world right now. But even that guy's gone. So, what we have to do to advance is head down to special detention and do something kind of tricky we have to jump over here to this lever then to that then to this then to this and then wait for that water to come up then we can jump to that and it will drop us down into this bucket so yeah this kind of confused me because i'm so used to jumping into an object and then using it myself so when i jumped into that thing before and it was like oh it i can't use it at all then I just didn't even think about it, so... That's a pretty clever puzzle there, I think. But this guy finally found his spanner and he can put the one bolt in that broke the entire generator. And yay, the power is back up. Cool. I guess everything's coming back up. The security's all back up. Although the prison is a long gone, I think. Trick time. Alright, so what can we do now? Let's have a look. Water drop again. Ooh, that was a really good timing, actually. <laughs> uh, the power supply. Let's manipulate this and see what happens. Appears to be some kind of control panel. I might be able to operate it. I'll give it a try. It did something. What are they messing with? That almost looks like a robot. Some lamps came on. Not quite sure what that means. Maybe that changed the situation, though. So I guess we have to do that for something, so I'm glad I did that. Uh, maybe there's lever next? Oh, that's the electric chair! So that's how they're going to kill Jowd. Uh, let's see what these guys are talking about. Hey, do you think this execution was really the right thing to do? What the heck are you saying? I mean, I know this country has a death penalty. But how many years has it been since to use this chair? Yeah, I don't know, it is quite a bit of dust and dirt on it. I bet that's what happened. All that debris damaged the wiring. Well, I think it was divine retribution. Don't be stupid. The prisoner wanted to be executed, you know. Yeah, but... Oh, shit. So... S oh, no, he did die. Inspector Jowd, I guess I was too late. So when are they going to pick up his body? They'll be sending over a car from the public cemetery pretty soon. After we hand over the body and clean up the, mortu the mortuary, we're done. Yeah, okay. 
Uh, Lynn's going to be devastated, but we do have our powers of time manipulation and all that. So let's see if we can get over there and save him. But yeah, still, even after going through all this effort to try and save him, and the prison like went down, he still died. Oh, I just saw the water drops again. So maybe we have to jump across while they come down. No, it's a bit too far away. This chair scares me. I don't want to repair it or get anywhere near it. Who knows when it's going to blow up again? Or let loose with the juice. Yikes, shut up, man. Okay, so that's what we have to do. We have to um, shock it while the water's coming down. Ah. <laughs> Why do I get a feeling this is going to kill the guy? Well, hopefully he'll be okay. So let's wait for it to come down. Uh, a bit too soon. Maybe that's good. Oh, wait a second. Oh, yeah, we can only trick her in the real world. So let's do it. Okay. You have to do it way in advance. Oh, that worked. Hey, cool. Now into his spanner. I just got a shock. Well, I'm glad you're okay anyway. And now we jump up to the bulb, I guess. Because we can't jump to the left. From here, we can rock the headpiece. That'll fall down. That guy throws it over there. And if we rock this back, we should be able to get over Detective Jowd. Alright, Jowd. Let's see what's going on here. Looks like this is just an internal phone too. It doesn't call outside. So the only places I can go with the telephone are other phones within the building that are already possessed. Yep. We now have access to four internal phones, which is cool. Alright, Jowd. Talk to you, man. What's going on? Hey, can you hear me? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, wait a second. Where am I? This is the ghost world, the land of the dead, Detective Jowd. Detective Jowd? Who is that? Is that me? Oh boy, not you too. This is getting old. Guess I'll have to give the usual explanation. The dead lose their memories. Yeah, Cecil's been through this so many times. Oh, so I'm dead, am I? I didn't realize that. That's why I can't remember anything right now. That's fine with me. Huh? I don't like a messy room, but I hate cleaning up even more. Not having my memories is a welcome thing. Now it has... Wait, what? Memories like trash. Alright, so Jowd has some serious problems. But yeah, we need his memories, because how else are we going to save him? We promised Lin, yeah, we'd try and stop the execution. Lin? Hmm. It looks like I still have a few bits and pieces of garbage left lying around. There he is. Hey, Jowd. I remember now about Lin, Jowd, and the execution. And what about you? Who are you? I'm Cecil, I'm looking for my memories, or trash as you call it. Cecil. Does my name ring a bell? I think you know me. Yeah, he had that picture of us in his cell. But apparently he doesn't remember too much. That's alright, I guess you'll find out when you get your memories back. But for now, I'd like you to come back with me. Back to four minutes before your execution. Let's go. This is the past, four minutes before my death. That's right, you'll get to see your own execution. And then we're going to change your fate. But first, can I ask you a question? Lynn told you, didn't she, about what I did? Yeah, she did. Then is it really the right thing to do to save a guy like me? I don't know. But Lynn believes it is. And yeah, we're choosing to believe in Lynn too. Okay, let's get started. So this guy was in his cell, eating his chicken, as usual. And there's the rock star again. Letting his buddy know that the guards are coming through. Oh, but he got clogged. 
Oh shit. <laughs> well, we know the curry guy's okay, because he's still sleeping down there in the cell. So these guys are getting everything set up for the execution. And Zhao just finished. Man, how are we going to save this guy? <laughs> if he's inside a friggin' prison, how are we going to help him escape? And plus, how can we even stop the execution? Unless, um... Okay, so we did that. Which will probably trigger the curry guy's cell, right? All I can really think is that maybe we can stop the generator ourselves? Because that would prevent the electric chair from turning on, and I'm assuming that's what killed him. So the time's finally here, huh? Yeah, wonder how many years it's been. The last time, you weren't even here yet. I never thought I'd have to attend an execution. But you know. I wonder why the Justice Minister suddenly signed the order. There's definitely something up with that. Once again, it is really, really weird, because I doubt you could just ask to be executed. With everything else going on, I wouldn't be surprised if they stopped going behind the scenes here. Alright, so these guys are heading down. Prisoner D99, it's time! L let's -a go! Alright, men, I'm ready. Sorry you have to go through this unpleasant experience. Uh, and once again, I think all these guys in the police force really respect Jowd. I really hope he tells us what happened. Prepare to test. Throw the switch. Oh, okay. So I suppose technically the chair did kill him, but not how you would expect. So this is an execution, huh? It seems to me there's got to be a safer way to do it. Ha ha ha, it must be nice to have no memory like that. It makes things more interesting, I envy you, I really do. It's no laughing matter than me. That was an example of a failed execution, although the outcome was the same. Failed? They haven't carried out an execution in a long time. They dragged that old chair out from under some mothballs, and I guess it had a short. So I guess that means if I can stop the explosion... Oh, I didn't know about that. Then I'll just be executed as planned, and I'll still wind up just as dead. So what should I do? Beats me. You're the one who came to save me, you figure it out. He's not making this easy, yeah. 